Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to the Reptile Barn. As promised, I just wanted to show you guys what we have been working on. So, if you'll come with me, we're in the backyard. It's a bright and beautiful day. <clears throat> you may recall, if you've been watching our channel for a long time, we used to have three sheds here. Now, as you can see, there's only one, and it's empty. We have been moving our feeder operation to the back of the yard. Built a couple more platforms for them as well. So this was quite the operation. <laughs> shed one here is now the rodent shed. Got our carbon filters, fans, lights, our ARS rack, our homemade rack. It's almost empty. Yeah. So it hasn't changed. We did upgrade the uh, insulation. The insulation is much better now, much more uh, complete and much more secure. Before winter hits, we will also be insulating the floor. We'll probably just take foam insulation and spray it underneath the platform. We're leaving this cracked because, believe it or not, Alaska does get warm occasionally, and it's been very warm recently. Uh, this week, we may break the all-time record for Anchorage, which is like 90 degrees. It's not, you know, for most of you guys, you're like, well, that's not that hot. For us, that's really hot, okay? Um, shed 2 is the rabbitry. So we moved shed two over here. There's a bunch of rabbits in here, I promise. <laughs> They're just hiding. Whoopsie, almost kicked that over. Oh, gotta step high. So, yeah, nothing too crazy in here. You can see a bunch of little rabbits in there. Yeah, there you are. Hi guys, hiding from me. They're mad at us because we moved them yesterday. Uh, we're about to replace a few of our oldest females. So this little white one, if she turns out to be a female, she will be replacing someone in our breeding colony. I see that someone is nesting. That's interesting. So somebody's about to have babies, it looks like. You can see they've been pulling fur and stuff. It's so hot outside that they don't have to pull a lot of fur. Um, it's been 80s for like two weeks and it's going to continue to be 80s for a while. So they're, they're doing great. But yeah, there's, you know, seven or eight rabbits in here. Our extra hay. Oh, here comes Athena. This is my brother's dog. Sweet little pup. Hey, don't eat my rabbits. Nope, get back, sweetie. Ugh. And over here, you remember our quail. We just moved the greenhouse to over here. They're doing great. Uh, sometimes I have to tarp off the front of the greenhouse. That's what this is here, because it gets really hot in there because it's a greenhouse. But they're doing awesome in there. Got a bunch of just sticks and brush and stuff for them. And I piled something over it so they have some shade if they want it. They've been loving the dirt, absolutely loving it been rolling around in it, dust bathing themselves. So yeah, we are really liking having our feeder operation all back here. Got them some more shade than they had over there on the side of the house. You can hear the quail in the background. So yeah, that's what we've been working on. It was quite the process because these two sheds already had their foundations. And we really didn't want to detach the sheds from the foundations when we were moving everything. But between the shed and the foundation, you know, the platform that they're sitting on, uh, we're talking like 600 or 700 pounds. Uh, and they're big and bulky and just unwieldy. So we ended up getting uh, nice, thick PVC pipes and it's just some, you know, two by fours. And we ended up rolling these sheds across the yard. It was actually kind of fun. It was kind of cool to see it work. But yeah, um, that has been our major accomplishment 
for the last week. <coughs> I have been a little bit sick this whole time because there are some wildfires burning south of Anchorage and they are just flooding Anchorage with smoke. Have been for a week. Um, it's been kind of crazy. Sometimes it lo- we look up and you can't even see the sky. It's just it's really been smoky. So my asthma has been acting up and my allergies. Lots of people are having breathing problems. But it seems much clearer today than it has been. So that's good. Because the weather's been so nice. We want to come outside and come outside and you can't even breathe. Anyway, that is our update as far as our feeder items go. Sorry, this is a big water thing toy (laughs) right in the way but yeah thank you for bearing with us as we have been pretty irregular posting videos Uh, again like I said in the last video we're trying to get back our groove but we've been out here for 12 hours a day working on stuff Um, it's been it's been long days Uh, anyway that's all I've got for you today thank you for watching till next time we're the reptile barn Yeah.